The new LGBT retirement community getting set to open in Palm Springs. We've got a sneak peek for you. KMIR News at 5 starts now. Tonight we have an exclusive sneak peek of the Valley's first LGBT senior assisted living community. It's in Palm Springs and construction should be completed in a few months, they're saying. Jitzel Puente is live tonight in the newsroom with more for us. Hey, Jitzel. Janet Gino, while this complex caters to the LGBT community, management says any senior is welcome to apply. There are different levels of care available depending on what the individual needs, and there's already a waiting list. Palm Springs is making history with its first LGBT senior assisted living community, the second one in the state. We've been out in the community talking to people and we're just getting an overwhelming response to this and we're, we couldn't be more excited. The chief operating officer says he saw a need in the valley for this kind of project. It's located on Palm Canyon Drive. There's really nothing in the community that can serve the LGBT seniors and uh, so it's a well-needed product. One prospective tenant says he is looking forward to seeing Stonewall Gardens come to life and live up to its mission to serve aging LGBT residents. I would prefer to be in a community where I can feel comfortable, um, where I don't have to hide anything. He says this community is affordable with his current long-term care insurance, and he likes the idea it will only have 24 units compared to other larger assisted living communities. I think that you could get to know people better here in a smaller place. Stonewall Gardens will provide three meals a day and offer 24-7 assistance with skilled health care professionals. We have different care plans for the different individuals. So there might be some residents that need very little care and there may be some residents that need a little bit more than that. The grand opening of Stonewall Gardens is scheduled for August, but residents will be able to move in a month later. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Jitzel Puente, back to you. 